Good morning. It is almost time for me to go to work and it is so cold. It actually snowed yesterday. So what I like to do because I'm always cold. I'm a little heater friend here and I put it in front of my clothes and then I stand in front of it um, to change because I like to be warm. <laughs> so just a tip in case you're cold in the morning, um, get yourself a little, a little space heater friend. Good morning everyone, it's Monday, November 22nd. Um, it is gray and rainy, but kind of warm. There we go, I am also <laughs> riding a little bit just for energy flow. School is, my part with school is done, so I figured I would do this while I'm waiting for groceries. And later I'll be going out to have tea with a friend. Today's look is more of a European look, cool for a rainy day to go grab tea. So we went in and they they seemed a little weirded out that we were there. But they were really busy, so I just took that as they're busy. And we were kind of getting in the way, which is one fear of mine. So we'll check that box. And then as she's creating these bouquets for my friend and I, I then realized that the open sign was flipped and it was actually closed. So we walked in to a store that we probably were not supposed to go into. And we asked them to make us things when they were closed. They never said anything. They were very kind. And they made us our bouquets. But I was always afraid of this. And I decided to be brave and I did it and it was exactly what I was afraid of. So moral of the story is do what you're afraid to do and typically it's not what you think but even when it is like today you'll still walk away possibly with a gorgeous bouquet of flowers. So there you go there's the lesson of the day I hope your day is better than that, um, but really, I had a fabulous time with my girlfriend and we got flowers.
freezing out today, so I'm gonna go with my go-to barista look, which is jeans, nice t-shirt, and a funky sweatshirt. I might go with a sweater. We shall see. Okay, so I'm going to work and I have my jeans and a little t-shirt, and I can't decide between my more fall looking one and my gray. So pullover, a cardigan, warm, cool. What are we thinking here? And then there's this. Okay, this is my outfit for today. I will put on my sneakers, black sneakers with this. Um, but this is it. I'm going to be on bar for most of the day, so. Still got to look cool getting coffee all over me. is just my quick go-to barista outfit as always jeans simple top and a sweater I return it but I I like the overall concept really really love the wash but I, I don't like what it's doing right here and the t-shirt, it's thick, which I love. The overall idea, love. The details of it all, <sighs> disappointed. I wanted to invite you in on my Black Friday shopping in no way affiliated. None of this is ads. This is just pure. This is me and how I shop and where I want my money to go um, when I am buying for myself. Support um, helping farmers get um, their, what is it, regenerative organic certificate. Um, so it's organic movement through research, farmer training, and consumer education. Um, I, the fact that their Black Friday is a way to give more to these places, it's just like that is where I want my money to go. So I'm going to be doing some shopping and I'm going to show you the things that I want to buy. And then I will, of course, do a haul when they get here and put my tea down because um, I have to have an after work tea. All the time so sometimes it's wine but lately it's been detox teas because this there's been some stress and and I was telling um, my friend today that I want to go for the wine but I really care about my body so it's tea we'll get to wine tomorrow I'm sure okay so I'm gonna flip this around okay just so you guys can see this is what we're talking about. Look at these beautiful people and land. I am so excited to be supporting this. Okay, here is my cart so far. I'm in love with this. Basics, because it's me. I really love this quilted coat and a sweater and some black pants. Here's my thing now. Do we want this creamy cardigan or do we want toasted almond? Guys, 
this is literally the issue I am dealing with right now, which is so small. And, but look at how creamy and lovely that is. So both will work with my skin and hair. Stay tuned for what I end up getting. Okay, so they are doing an actual sale, 20% off store-wide. How gorgeous this stuff is. Again, not affiliated whatsoever. I'm just showing you what I have been digging. Now, I've been watching this company for a while, completely obsessed with their style. Gorgeous, I posted this the other day because this is such a fun idea. Okay, now. For this year's Give Back Friday, we are partnering with the Jane Goodall Institute. I will show you a couple of things that I want, but we'll leave the rest as a surprise for the unboxing. You're either silver or gold based on your coloring. I feel like I look better in silver than gold in most occasions. Most occasions. So I have a ton of gold. I think I'm actually going to invest in some silver this go around. So. I've been wanting a necklace like this for a while and have not been able to find really what I'm looking for. And lo and behold, it is right here. Add to cart, please. Great choice. Why, thank you. Okay, so the other thing that I wanted to mention, and we'll get into it in, in its own YouTube, um, but you should pick a power item, right? And this I've read in books and I've seen many stylists do this, but pick one piece, one power piece that will, you grab it no matter what you're feeling, will always feel empowered. However I'm feeling, I put a good cocktail ring on or just a really statement ring on, I'm good. I am good. So. Keeping it casual, we're gonna go hang out with friends. So um, I still kept a warm fall type sweater and then just put my go-to drop shoulder coat over it to tie the whole thing together. I guess you could stick it, you could slide it. Just for Kanku. Yeah, but imagine how many. Two. 